Welcome back to the channel. In today's video, we are going to be looking at the cast of Prison Break and how they have changed over the years. We will also be sharing some interesting facts that you probably have never heard of. Let's get started. It took four and a half hours to apply the tattoo to Wentworth Miller on set. The character of D.B. Cooper is based on an actual person who in 1971, after hijacking an airliner, extorted $200,000 from its owner, Northwest Orient, and leaped off the airborne plane with 21 pounds of $20 bills strapped to his body. He was never found. The theory is that he was killed because his parachute didn't deploy. Paul T. Schuring had said that the initial concept for the series, a man deliberately getting himself sent to prison in order to break out again, was suggested to him by a female colleague of his, Don Peruz. He thought it was a great idea, but was initially stumped as to why someone would embark on such a strange mission or how he could stretch the idea out long enough for a TV show. He later came up with the idea of the wrongfully accused brother, and the conspiracy subplot. He then started work on writing the pilot script for the show. Wentworth Miller was a last-minute casting choice. He started filming about a week after auditioning and being cast. 13 episodes had originally been ordered, but due to the success of the show, Fox extended it to a full season. Wentworth Miller and Dominic Purcell are very close friends in real life. They also portray criminal partners Captain Cold and Heatwave in the 2014 show The Flash and its spin-off, DC's Legends of Tomorrow in 2016. They are actually responsible for the creation of its fifth season. While working together on the set of DC's Legends of Tomorrow, Purcell suggested a reboot of this series to Miller. Miller agreed, took the idea to Fox, pitched it as a series, and the network picked it up. The electric chair is not used as a primary instrument of execution in the state of Illinois, where the series is set. Originally, the method of execution scripted for Lincoln's death was a lethal injection. For shock value, however, this was changed to the electric chair. The state of Illinois currently has a moratorium on the death penalty. The filming location, the Old Joliet Prison, actually only has cells stacked too high. To be able to show the cells stacked three high, a studio set was constructed. According to an Instagram post from Dominic Purcell, posted in December 2017, Season 6 of Prison Break is currently in the works. And that wraps it up for this video. Thank you for watching and make sure you subscribe to the channel for more great content just like this.